again everyone, uh, this is Volt Wolf, uh, also known as Kid Takashi, if you know me, um, on Divine Art or YouTube, so, this is the second half of my comic making tutorial for YouTube, and, yeah, music in the background. Uh, new, new surprise, uh, I colored w during the this, uh, why between the time I was making this so and cuz this is not a coloring tutorial so um, you this is the uh, this is finishing off with how I finish my comics always with text and the last text framework from before so you uh, crap it's lagging so I have to just guess what to say this is uh, the comic page four for of ever changing. So you, I'm gonna be skipping between things because uh, otherwise I would may have to make a third or probably fourth video just because to uh, finish it. So yeah, uh, I need. I'm gonna start it off with this uh, at the top and whatever. Mm. Uh, this is the fourth page of Ever Changing, as I said before, and it's flipping between music. Uh, you'll see it at the end, but this music is from the Final Fantasy games. Uh, this fir the first three, no, the first three you're gonna hear, and the ending, the credit one, are all from Final Fantasy three, a game on DS. So yeah, love the game. Anyways. Uh, if I'm gonna try to use the rest of the time, um, but yeah, this is the text tool, and when it comes to the framework part, I'll help with the finish tutorial because text is easy. So, ever changing is basically, uh, if I didn't say in the last one, it's a comedy, drama, romance, whatever you want to call it, and yeah, incorporate some Japanese stuff into it. Uh, as well as American, whatever. Uh, the main characters at the moment, um, they are the character you've already seen, Apple, who you probably already know who's based off of, uh, the, another character, Mew, another person who it's based off of on YouTube, uh, and the third, fourth, third person is called... Dante, yeah, that's it, uh, who's based off another person, I don't remember whether they have a count or not on YouTube, and if they do, I don't know what it is, and the last one, of course, based off me, oh yeah, but the character's Kiari, and if you heard the name before, Kaim, or Dodger, or whatever, as you're gonna see in a minute, or maybe not, are based off of no one. I just need side characters, so... And yes, if you didn't already know, this is, uh... The series which the char my bird character, Twiggy, derives from. Who you also may be seeing soon in, uh... The Core's upcoming Twiggy tournament. Yay. Ooh, and this song's a personal favorite. This one is, uh... By, I believe, called Ronin. It's the piano version of... A song called Somnus, which is Latin for I think it's dream, but meh. Don't trust me on that. Uh, so ever changing takes place in a mythical world. At the moment, I I don't really have a name for it. Some Japanese name I don't even know how to pronounce. So, yay. Uh, the main island in it is called Lune, as I pronounce it, but other people may pronounce it a different way. It starts off in the city known as Summerton, I believe, yeah, that's the name, Summerton, or whatever, and has four main cities and a bunch of side stuff, which will be seen later in the story, and uh, at the bottom of the page now, so I'm going to go back to a tutorial in a moment, but yeah, the main characters are the four I said, the takes place on Lune, Summerton, all that crap. Four cities are known as Summerton and uh, out of time. Alright, uh, back to the tutorial. As you can see from what I did last time with the 
rectangle tool for the framework is uh, I would put it around the picture but this time I'm doing it around the text since it's text framework if you can see it or not I don't know if you can read that if it's small or what so I do this last thing and I don't always do it on each every text depending whether it's a uh, what do you call it? It's if it's um if it's text where people are talking or it's sound text, aka onomatopoeia, whatever, or na or narrations, whatever. And uh, yeah, there it is. Uh, if you've seen the character sheets, that's uh, Muse Lollipop of Doom. Very fun object and. I'm going to use this last remaining time, yeah, because my computer lo saves and loads crap very slowly, so yeah. Well, this is the end of the videos, and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, even though it was more of an explanation, I'll never change it in the tutorial.